Howdy folks, welcome to my Security Plus course and also welcome to the Burning Ice Tech channel. First of all folks, if you're wondering why this video is so short, it's because this is just the introduction video explaining what the course is all about and what the objectives are. The full official course will start from the next video in this playlist, so keep an eye out for that. Alrighty, so let's start with a little bit about myself first, the trainer. So for those of you that are new to the channel, I'm a certified IT trainer and I've been for a very long time. I train many courses from many vendors, not just CompTIA. When it comes to IT training, I have more than 15 years of IT experience. Well, it's actually probably closer to 20 years now, come to think of it. I also have lots and lots of in the field experience, which I tend to use in my training to explain some of the topics. And it really helps when it comes to giving you folks real life examples and real life demonstrations. So the fact that I've been working in the field for a very long time is really going to help you guys when I, when I give you guys examples and all that. So that's a bit about me, folks. Now onto the actual course overview and objectives. The full official Security Plus course consists of 16 modules. That's if we're talking about the SY0701 version of the course. So this video course is obviously based on that version and that version was released on the 7th of November, 2023. This video course will cover all 16 modules of the Security Plus course and there will be a full dedicated video for each of those 16 modules. Most videos might be more than an hour long due to covering a whole freaking module. So guys, you've got to remember, we're going to be covering a whole freaking module in each of these videos. So they're bound to be more than an hour long. So please don't complain about that. At the end of the day, I'm giving you guys this content for free. So to help you guys with that, since these videos are going to be so long and since they're going to be containing so much content, timestamps will be added into each video's description to make finding specific topics easier and quicker. So if you're looking for a specific topic that you want to go and revise on or you just want to go and study a specific topic, uh, maybe you just want to go back to a certain timestamp because you didn't finish watching the video previously, there are timestamps in the video description which are going to help you find something quicker. This course will cover enough to pass the Security Plus International Certification Exam. The course can be used by people who want to brush up on certain topics. All right, folks, and then for who is this video course intended for? So who can watch this video and who should not be watching this video? Who can make use of it? Well, guys, the audience of this course or the course was designed. I made this course of certain people in mind. So this course can be used by folks who are preparing, most importantly, for the SY0701 certification exam. So if you need to go and write Security Plus, the CompTIA certification exam, yes, this course was especially intended for those people. Um, I delivered this course specifically in such a manner so that you guys will be able to pass the exam. It's the full official course and I'm delivering it the way it was intended to be delivered. So if your intention is to go and sit for the exam, Yes, you can pass the exam after you've finished watching the course. This course can, however, also be used by other folks. The course can be used by people that just want to brush up on some security things. So maybe you used to know about something and now you forgot a bit about it. So yeah, maybe you can use it for that. The course can also alternatively be used to troubleshoot a security or a technical related problem that you're facing maybe in the office or at home or whatever. And then lastly, folks, this course can also be used just to improve your general knowledge of security. So maybe you just want to learn a bit more about security. Well, if that's the case, this course is just perfect for you. All right, folks. And then before I conclude this introductory video, just a bit about the exam for this course. So the exam, well, the current version of the exam, the current latest version of the exam is the SY0701 version of the exam. So this exam, you will have 90 minutes to write this exam. So try and do this within 90 minutes. That's an hour and a half. You will get no more than 90 questions. You could possibly get less than 90, but it'll be no more than 90 questions. The passing score for this exam is 750. Now, of most vendors, that'll be out of 1,000, and that would mean that normally you would need to get 75% or more. Now, CompTIA exams are out of a scale of 900. So you need to score 750 out of a scale of 900. So that means you need to actually in reality get 83.3% to pass this exam. That's, yeah, that's a lot more than most exams. 
The types of questions you can expect are for the most part going to be multiple choice, but there will also be performance-based questions, which they call PBQs. We're actually going to have to go and do something practically. And then just in case you guys did not hear me say this earlier, this version of the exam was released on the 7th of November, 2023. So it'll most likely only get retired somewhere between May and November, 2027. That is just a rough estimate because normally each version of the course lasts approximately three and a half years. So yeah, I can't say for sure exactly when it will be, but that's more or less when we expect CompTIA to retire this version of the exam and release a newer version of the exam along with a new course. All right, folks, so that's it for the course introductory. I will see you guys in the first module of Security Plus, so keep an eye out for that.